What's up? What's up, guys? I am Shane, and we're about to take over the Normandy from Captain Anderson. I've got big I hate Udina. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. The ship is yours now. Now, is he just stepping down as commanding officer of the ship, or is he retiring completely? Perfect ship for us that way. Feed her well, Doc. I'll take good care of her, sir. I know you will, Doc. I want the truth. Why are you stepping down, sir? You needed your own ship. A Spectre can't answer to anyone but the Council. And it's time for me to step down. Come clean with me, Captain. You owe me that much. I was in your shoes 20 years ago, Sister Lee. They were considering me for the Spectres. Why didn't you ever mention this? What was I supposed to say? I could have been a Spectre, but I blew it. I failed, Commander. It's not something I'm proud of. Ask me later and I'll tell you the whole story. For now, all you need to know is... I was sent on a mission with Saren, and he made sure the Council rejected me. Yeah, that's right. This is a conversation we have to have later. It came it's not going to happen right here. Now you have a chance to make up for my mistake. I won't let you down, sir. Saren's gone. Don't even try to find him. But we know the Doc. The Condor. He's got his Geth scouring the Traverse looking for clues. We had reports of Geth in the Pharaoh system shortly before our colony there dropped out of contact. And there have been sightings around Noveria. Oh, very is fun. I don't remember Pharaohs at all. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. The Reapers are the real threat. I'm with the Council on this one, Shepard. I'm not sure they even exist. But if they do exist, the conduit's the key to bringing them back. Stop Saren from getting the conduit, and we stop the Reapers from returning. I'll stop him. We have one more lead. Matriarch Benizi, the other voice in that recording. She has a daughter, a scientist. Oh, I'm well aware of Liara. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. We have reports she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau cluster. Sounds like we should head for the Artemis Tau cluster. Wait, Pharos is... Okay, I just remembered Pharos. Don't answer to us. Your actions still reflect on humanity as a whole. You make a mess and I get stuck cleaning it up. God, I kind of want to be like, that's your job, but... Any harder on you, Ambassador. Trying to be Paragon here. Remember, you were a human long before you were a Spectre. This is the one game where it's like... I don't really want to stick with Paragon or Renegade. Just, like, answer how I want to answer. And just mess with Udina the whole time. So, uh... I'm going to grab this Reaper real quick. Or Keeper, not Reaper. I'm very good at words. Let's see, Anderson, do you want to talk now or no? Yes, Commander. How are you holding up? Honestly, this isn't how I pictured my career coming to an end. Pushing papers really isn't my thing. But you're the one who can stop Sam. I believe in you, Shepard. If that means I have to step aside... So be it. Tell me what happened with you and Saren 20 years ago. It's close to 20 years ago now. Ambassador Goyle was our representative here on the Pharaoh. Like Udina, she wanted to get a human. I like Goyle better. She chose me. The Council sent Saren to keep an eye on me and evaluate my performance. Just like they sent Nihilus to keep tabs on you. Why weren't you honest with me? It's not something I'm proud of. I had a chance to become the first human specter, and I failed. Saren made sure of that. I think I deserve the whole story. We had intel on a rogue scientist being funded by Batarian interests. He was trying to set up a facility to develop illegal AI technology out in the Berg. Alliance intel had done all the work, but the Council wanted a specter involved. We compromised. I was assigned to help Saren in his investigation. We tracked the scientist to a refining facility. On I just can't imagine Anderson out there, like with a gun and everything. I don't know why. I think they just did that good with his character design to make him sort of be the old man. Capture the scientist, sneak back out. Quick, quiet, and a minimum of bloodshed. I'm guessing things didn't go as planned. Saren and I split up to cover more ground. Then, about halfway through the mission, there was a massive explosion in the refinery core. Officially, it was ruled an accident. But I think Saren detonated it on purpose to draw off the enemy guards. How many casualties? The explosion tore the refinery to shreds. The whole place was on fire. 
Black chemical clouds poured out into the atmosphere. Nobody inside survived. There was a camp for the workers and their families nearby. Between the fires and the toxic fumes, the final death count was over 500. Mostly civilians. Good job, Saren. The target was eliminated. Mission accomplished. And I ended up taking the blame. That ended all talk of me joining the staff. Saren caused the explosion. How'd he pin it on you? In his report, Saren accused me of blowing his cover. He said it was my fault the guards were ready for it. He claimed that's why it turned into a massacre. Saren's report was all the proof the council needed to kill my chances of becoming a staff. Don't blame yourself, Captain. I don't. I blame Saren. I think he wanted things to go bad. Yep, he sure did. And he did well. Unlike you, Anderson. Maybe he was just trying to make me look bad to keep humans out of the spectrum. If so, he pulled it off. Why'd you let him get away with it? Who do you think the council was going to listen to? Me? Or their best agent? I had a bad feeling about him right from the start. I should have been more careful. Maybe I could have stopped things before they got out of hand. All right. I care about is stopping sound. Yeah, this is about to be a conversation loop. It's no good. But, all right. I'll be here if you need me. Bye, Anderson. 34 experiences for looking at the weapons, and let's go. And loading screen. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. Heard what happened to Captain Anderson. He survives a hundred battles and then gets taken down by backroom politics. Just watch your back, Commander. If things go bad on this mission, you're next on the chopping block. Captain Anderson should be the one in charge. It's like I'm stealing the ship from him. Yeah, the captain got screwed. But it's not like you could have stopped it. Nobody's blaming you. Everyone on this ship's behind you, Commander. 100%. Intercom's over. Thank you, Joker. Got anything you want to say to the crew? All right. I don't I don't want to talk to them. I guess I have to. Commander Shepard speaking. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. I won't lie to you, crew. This mission isn't going to be easy. For too long, our species has stood apart from the others. Now it's time for us to step up and do our part for the rest of the galaxy. Time to show them what humans are made of. Our enemy knows we're coming. When we go into the Traverse, Saren's followers will be waiting for Hello, us. Hello, a bunch of faceless people we'll who are all going to die at the beginning of the next game. Humanity needs to do this. Not just for our own sake, but for the sake of every other species in Citadel space. Look at them. They're just looking at her like, you racist. I you all, we will stop him. Well said, Commander. The captain will be proud. The captain gave up everything so I could have this chance. We can't win. Yes, ma'am. I got four Paragon points for that one. Alright, give me that for some XP. Alright, I have to go around the front. Do I wanna I need to talk to my crewmates real quick. Who has missions? Garrus. Does Rex have one? I'll talk to Caden. Even though this is how he starts every dialogue conversation. Anything you need, Commander? Just trying to get a sense of where the crew's at. Thoughts? I've wasted enough of your time for now, Commander. We'll have time for personal debriefing later. We'll talk another time. She looks like a brunette in this lighting. Okay. And everyone else, I believe, is downstairs. I just saw... There it is, Shepard's Locker. I got a new shotgun. Rex will appreciate that. And loading screen. This is only so I can unlock cool missions later in the game. So everyone loves Garrus. So I need to make sure I talk to him after every mission. Thanks for bringing me on board, Commander. I knew working with the Captain would be a better time. Have you worked with the 
like it before? Well, no, but I know what they're like. Inspector Tinker over there. I'm free to handle things you order. He's set to bury bodies. Damn girls back there always are for that. For the most part, the rules are there for a reason. Maybe. But sometimes they do Garrus wants to play Renegade so bad. So bad he wants to be Renegade. I mean, I'm still wearing the CSEC armor, but you know. And without CSEC headquarters looking over my shoulder, I can get the job done by chance. If getting the job done means endangering innocent people, then no. We'll get the job done right, not fast. Got it? I wasn't trying to. I was trying to get Poor Garrus. Uh, Ashley, I have no interest in talking to you. Good story. Good story. The Krogans lived for centuries. Don't tell me you haven't had a few interesting adventures. Well, there was this one time the Turians almost wiped out our <laughs> freaking Rex. That was fun. I heard about that. You know, they almost did the same to us. It's not the same. It seems pretty much the same to me. So your people were infected with the genetic mutation? An infection that makes only a few in a thousand children survive birth? And I suppose it's destroying your entire species? I suppose it isn't all the same. I don't expect you to understand. But don't compare humanity's fate with the Krogan's. I was just making conversation. I wasn't trying to upset you. Your ignorance doesn't upset me, Shepard. As for the Krogan. He says this now. It's a genophage infector, but it's not what's killing us. Are your people really dying? We're sure not getting any stronger. We're too spread out. None of us are interested in staying in our own system. Lots of species have left their homes and prospered. But they go to colonize new worlds. We're not settlers. We're warriors. We want to fight. Sorry, now I'm just getting all the answers I can get. Ask the Solarians if you want details. They made it. All I know, it makes breeding nearly impossible. Thousands die in stillbirth. Most never get that far. Every Krogan is infected. Every one. And no one rushes to the Krogan try to find a cure. When was the last time you saw a Krogan scientist? If you ask a Krogan, would he rather find a cure for the genophage or fight for credit? He'll choose fight at the top. It's just who we are, Shepard. I can make This is true because the Krogans got pulled out. They didn't actually find it themselves. The Turians sort of found them, used them to fight in the Ragnite Wars, and we'll get all this information later. Uh, I don't think there's anything... I'm not going to talk to Tali. I don't think there's anything there. I might be wrong. I'll check that later. But now we're going to go to... Find Liara. And explore the galaxy. And get off this elevator. Alright, so... Open the door. I still don't want to talk to Presley. Alright, so zoom out.
Now we do get to go... I went too far. We don't get to go to Earth in this game, but we do eventually get to go to the moon. Alright, Asteroid X-5-7. I think that's DLC. We'll go there after. So eventually what we'll do is I'll end up hitting all of these and investigating all, like, the lost planets. But for now... I don't remember where she is. I feel like this is correct. And if not, well, then loading screens. Alright, so I got distracted uh, and explored some planets and realized that I don't have a high electronic skill or anything like that, so I can't even do half the stuff on the planets. Also, anytime you go to an asteroid belt, make sure you sweep the whole thing because there's stuff hidden in there. But we're going to go to Therum because this is where Liara is. And uh, I just found out you can like have a scope on the Mako because I went to the other planet and got like bodied by like five dudes with sniper rifles and then I went through the second time and just hit up on a clifftop and apparently I can just snipe them out I didn't realize that so that will be helpful considering we have to fight through a bunch of geth here <sighs> I'm not looking forward to this I mean I've beaten this game on insanity before it's not necessarily that it's just the Mako was such a cool concept, and it's so bad. And I have fallen into the lava here more times than I'd like to admit. So now... Where... Is the first ambush coming from? I think we get a cutscene before the first one. I don't think there's really any side activities here. I'm just hoping that I find her in this episode, honestly. Alright, so far so good. But I think it's right around this bend is when the first dropship shows up. There it is. I see the reflect. Oh, yeah, there's the shadow. Never noticed that before. And I have definitely accidentally backed into the lava while shooting these things before. Oh, God. Oh, I thought they already took out my gun. Alright. Yeah, that scope helps out a ton. But those aren't the big ones. There's like a Colossus, right? And it is weird to think that like, oh, I'm killing these things. And they all share the same hive mind. Oh, yeah, there's the autosave. Only a fool punches a map back in the mouth. You should sneak around and pull its face. Alright, cannons it is. Ow. Please stop shooting me. Okay, that one's down. How many cannons do I have? Or is there a recharge? Alright, well he's dead. Ooh, he got one last hit in on me. Uh, I think there's a panel I gotta hit, right? Someone let me in. Hello. Huh. How do I get in?
Well, I did that. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, I got it. I still don't know how to get through the door, though. I'm an idiot. I was supposed to turn. That's what happened here. Slow and steady wins the race here. I'm not good at slow and steady. Jump too soon. Let the shields go. Oh god. Take you out because you're right there. Do I get less experience for killing him in this thing? I don't care. Alright. I missed one, apparently. Stop shooting the Mako! Oh, no, I just missed a rocket trooper. That's not that important. Alright, I know there's some supplies in here that I definitely need. And one of these has a trooper inside. Looks like this one, yep. Alright, good. I didn't want to take a rocket to the face. Also, I finally got around to doing my upgrades. So we got oh, I got some Krogan armor. A better sniper rifle. I might just do you know what? Let's do that now. Alright, do we got any cool upgrades here? No, I keep forgetting that does that. Combat... Combat Sensor 3 is not bad. We're good with that, though. This one does more damage, but we can only shoot it once. I think I'll stick with the Avenger. Oh, wait. And Rex. I haven't upgraded them enough. They can't use the armor. Alright. I need to be able to do... Is this going to let me do heavy armor? Yep, there we go. And then give me that new point. Alright. You can have... I need electronics, so I guess i got to crank up first aid. And, um, you can have that. So now I have some new armor I can wear, right? Yeah, there we go. Unfortunately, it's the Phoenix armor, which is not my favorite. Now I have to be pink. Now let's, what else do I got? Alright, I want more shields. I'll take that over anything. Open the gate. Come on, I just want to find Liara today. I don't think it's going to happen. Because we got to get through some stuff first. Might as well keep hunting down some stuff. Is there some stuff in here? I'm probably filming one more episode today, and then after that, I'll go through and, like, I'm going to sell some stuff and get some upgrades in between. You know, and take care of some of the stuff like that. So if I'm a little more buffed up by the next episode, that's why. It's like Pokemon level grinding, only it's Mass Effect. But in the meantime, I definitely... Don't want to mess around because we got to fight a couple of Krogan when we go to rescue Liara. And you pretty much got to kill them twice. There's nothing here. 
So, excuse me, Garrus. I mean, there might, there's probably something useful here. Also, it's really weird because you level up so often in this game because they added so many. All right. Hmm. Oh God. <laughs> I now I'm almost dead. Thank you, Rex. Thank you, Rex. You're the best. You know, I should have remembered he was in here. I didn't remember him being a shock trooper, though. So that's my mistake. Now I'm turned around. Where did I come from? This is the one. That's where the turrets were. So that's the wrong way. Okay. So... Turn around. I still hate this thing. And now it's about to get worse. Yep. We're already getting shot at from this thing. And that one all the way over there, too. Alright, that one's down. It is fun to, like, knock these things around with the Mako, but uh, I don't want to... Can't see. Mako's still in good shape. There's another drop ship, though. That's you dropped him up there. Okay. I think eventually we're gonna have to get out and get on foot. But in the meantime, I'm gonna take out these things as much as I can. You're down. There's another level up, though. Uh, there you are. There's definitely a strategy where I can just, like, shoot these things into the lava. But as long as I'm patient, we're fine. Oh, God. just keep going huh there we go ow hey buddy there's a colossus this thing's just eating all of my bullets There we go. Alright, and now we come up here, and there's going to be more waiting for us in this tunnel. But if I want to, I can just drive right past them. But I want that experience. Yeah, here goes my autosave. I see them on the radar. Joker, could you maybe drop this closer next time? No? Oh, there's another tunnel. That's right. That's what happens. I just think it's funny. They shoot rockets at me and I just jump and avoid it. And they're like, oh, damn, I didn't think of that one.
All right, so coming across this bend. Yeah, this is um, definitely the worst of the planets. That's why I like getting it done first. Get up here, get Liara, and get out. There is a t turret somewhere coming up that's going to surprise me. There is the rocket troopers. I did not jump and avoid those. Actually, all three of these planets have points where I have to get on the Mako, right? I just realized that. Every planet you have to get on the Mako. This one's just like the whole planet. And I believe here. All right, you're gonna shoot. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! We saved it. Yeah, we just ran him over. And goodbye, Mako. Okay, so thank you, auto save. There you are. Shepard, get under cover. Shepard, get in the cover. Get into cover. Just get in the cover. Thank you. Ow. Ow. Stop falling. Rex, get out of my way. Rex, go over there. Ow. There's one down. Alright, I gotta... Rocket troopers out. Just a regular trooper back here. Oh god. Okay. Now, real quick, because I got that level up. Um, which one should I go for now? You know what? I need some more damage from my assault rifles you can auto upgrade you can auto upgrade there's a the sniper rifle my sniper there we go there we go. Can we just... Can we kill them? There we go. Oh, you moved. Alright. There's that. Ow. Someone's shooting me. I don't know where they are. Oh, there you are. How did you get here? How did you get here?
Okay, take him out. We're almost there. I'm just gonna... Because you're not gonna shoot me with a rocket from close range. Oh, this is where the scary part comes in. Is we gotta take out a Colossus without the Mako. Yeah, this is about to be a bloodbath. Oh, those stupid things, too. I hate those so much. Hooray! Just what I wanted to do. Why did I choose insanity again? Um. Okay. Sniper? Sniper. Okay, the problem is they're all snipers, so it's kind of aggravating. See, like, I poked out for two seconds and my shields were gone. And Rex is dead. So that's also an issue. And I still don't know how to heal. Uh... Overkill? I'm poisoned. Oh, that shock trooper got behind. Oh, we're, uh, trooper got behind. Oh, we're, uh, uh, okay, well, good news, they're alive now. Rex is already dead again. Okay, well, I got shields back. There go my shields again. That's not the right button. See, and he keeps coming around. Just... Alright. It's, it's not gonna... Yep. Yeah. Okay. Let's try that again. Alright, so that's the stalker down at least. Storm uh, troopers are both down. God, these things are annoying. All right, it's two stalkers. I mean, at least Rex is good at being dead. He's got that going for him. All right, so now... Sniper? Um... Okay, that worked out pretty well. Did I kill him? I don't think I killed him. Maybe I did. Two 
you stop shooting at me? I think we're pretty okay right now. I mean, you know, my team's dead, but besides that. Alright, so Unity. Bring them back to life. Uh, can I get closer? Yeah, I'll take that for now. I don't think this is actually where I want to be. Never mind. Yep. As this thing just killed both my teammates. I think it's just him left, though. That's you. Okay, so now we are just down to that thing. Um, does he not see me? He doesn't see me. So I guess I'm gonna do So I guess I'm just gonna do this until he's dead. There, we did it. I can use Unity again, too. But I'm pretty sure we win. No, it says there's still one person here somewhere. There you are. That's why they're not coming back to life. I thought this game was about to freeze on me after I did it. I can beat you one-on-one. -on -one. All right. Come on, guys. There we go. They're all dead. We did it. And that is where I'm going to finally wrap up this episode. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, please be sure to hit like down below. If you want to see more from me, be sure to subscribe. Hit the notification bell to get it delivered directly to your inbox every single time I upload. Any thoughts, suggestions, whatever you may have, leave all that down in the comment section below. Everything you leave down there, I will always respond to, unless you are the trolliest of trolls. Thank you guys for watching. I'm Shane. I'm out.